What's up YouTube, how you doing? This is Mr. Tybox123 and in this video I'm going to be bringing you one of my most requested videos, my house tour version 2. So here we are guys, we are back with version 2 of my house tour. So many people asked me for this video, you wouldn't believe it. Behind the office tour that is, it's probably my most requested video. So as you guys probably know from the last one, and I'll leave the last one in a link down below, I'd pretty much just moved into my house then, so I didn't really have you know, a lot of the kind of sort of standard things that you'd have in it by that stage. It was just like the bare bones, no pictures or anything like that. So I've been here for just under a year now, so it's kind of coming together a little bit more. I haven't necessarily got everything I want in the house. There's still some bits and pieces that I'd like to kind of get together, but I'm not really in that kind of uh, situation where I just go out and just buy stuff for the sake of it until something better comes along. I usually kind of wait until I get exactly the thing that I want. So anyway, guys, let's crack on with the house tour. I'm gonna to pick the camera up off of the tripod and I'm gonna work our way around the house. Please do hit like on this video, guys. It really does help me out a lot and I'll be back with you in just a second. So here we are, guys. First of all, this is my office. There's some of my lighting on the roof there, some shelves, uh, my old iMac G4, uh, my camera in the middle of the room there. There's my Mac Pro with the Apple Cinema displays. And then we've got my cabinet with a load of boxes on top of some of my devices that I've bought in the past and that I still own, in fact. Uh, on the desk, got a whole bunch of the devices that I'm testing out at the moment. Got my Apple clock up there on the wall. And there's my TV over there. Little window. And there's the GoPro there recording on the windowsill because I'm going to be using some footage from that as well. In fact, this chair... Uh, he's going to be replaced in the next couple of weeks with a nice leather sofa that was just kind of temporary. But anyway guys, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to head straight on with the rest of the room tour because a lot of you guys have seen this before, this particular bit. And if you want to check out this room in a lot more detail, just head over to my channel and click on the search button and search for my setup v4 and in fact i'll leave a link to it down in the description below so anyway these are the double doors to the rest of the house so let's head out into the rest of the house so first up this is the kind of hallway area here or i don't know how you would sort of call it landing area whatever you want to call it um, this is kind of where you walk into when you come into the house so there's the front door just over there a little window with a flower on and in fact this is the downstairs toilet I don't know why the hell I'm showing you guys the toilet, but some of you might be interested. Got my Ralph Lauren towels there, which I absolutely love. Um, little mirror, little tree and some candles. And the most important thing, these smelly things that I've got all around the house. There's the dog there, Teddy, just sleeping on the stairs. And then we head off into the rest of the house. I'll just show you some of these pictures. This is one of them here that I've got that I quite like. I bought this from an art gallery. Um, they were really Jade's choice, but I kind of like them as well. Little mirror up there on the wall. You can see me in the mirror. Yo. Um, picture of uh, me and Jade there on the side. More of these kind of smelly things. Uh, molten brown candle just there. Little console table just in the hallway just to kind of put stuff on. And then I've got another one of these pictures as well on the wall here that I really like. In fact, if we get up close, they're kind of normal painting. And then this bit is all sort of glossy it's like really kind of i don't know smooth but anyway there's me touching her ass but let's move on now we move into the kitchen so in the kitchen we've got my dining room table just there with that kind of little thing on the top don't know what you'd call it like a statue thing um a couple of chairs over there for uh when we're kind of chilling out chatting in the kitchen and this is the rest of the kitchen got the extractor fan just up on the roof there and uh, the hob Obviously got like the sink, the oven, all that kind of stuff, uh, bin over there. Uh, in that cupboard actually, behind that door, it's just like a kind of storage cupboard. But this whole house I've wired in gigabit ethernet. So in there is like the patch panel and also the way that I connect all of the TVs via HDMI is gigabit ethernet. So it does HDMI over gigabit ethernet and all of the patching and stuff is all in that cupboard. So. I've got my sofa here just for in the kitchen and then on the wall just up here I've got a 42 inch Sony full HD TV that we just kind of use when we're in the kitchen. 
Just over there, we've got my marine fish tank. You can see I've got a clownfish and a load of anemones and a couple of other fish kind of going on in there. Love my aquariums. So then I've got this little kind of doorstop here, which is a bit like a sort of dog, if you like. And then I've got like a sort of utility room just out there, which is pretty boring. But just to kind of give you a view of my entire kitchen, there we go. Oh, and also I kind of forgot probably one of the most important things for you guys. Over here on the side, I've got this DAB digital radio that I actually did a review on, and it's fantastic. It's the Revo K2, and it's a great bit of kit for somewhere like in the kitchen. And then just on the front of it there, got an iPad wrapped in a beautiful iCarb and the skin, and that one we just kind of use in the kitchen, you know, when we're kind of lounging around, we want to look at stuff, or maybe guests are over and they want to look at stuff as well. And then quite often we just put the photos on there so they kind of flick around like a, like a digital photo frame. But anyway guys, that's the kitchen, let's move on. So here we go, back out into the hallway. And actually my arm is really aching. I'm not quite sure what that is there on the floor. Um, so let's work our way upstairs. There's Teddy again, say hello Teddy. Up you go. So let's work our way up, up to the first floor. And as we come up here, there's a kind of another sort of landing area. Picture on the wall there that I got because it kind of reminds me of, uh, of Jade. So I got that for Jade. Um, Teddy's wondering what the hell is going on. <laughs> and then we work our way into the bedroom. So this is our kind of uh, main bedroom. This is like the sort of master bedroom, if you like. And in fact, if we just head over to the side here, you can see on the side there, I've got an Apple wireless box that the name escapes me at the moment. Oh, that's it, an Airport Express. And then here, got another iPad that I quite often use just in there. Uh, that's an iPad uh, 4, because it's got the Thunderbolt port at the bottom, just there. So that's a 64 gig iPad 4. Got the remote control for my Samsung TV, a little docking station for charging stuff, and also the Apple TV remote as well. And that's the first one of my Airport Expresses just there. So as we work our way around, uh, I've just got my bed there. And then on the wall, there's a picture of me and Jade when we were in uh, Mauritius. And now we carry on working our way around. Just on the wall over here, I've got a huge uh, 60 inch Samsung Plasma Full HD 3D TV. And in fact, just connected to that as well, you can see I've got an Apple TV there as well. I think it's a third generation one, the full 1080p one. And then uh, just a couple of little bits and pieces on the side, photos and jewelry and whatnot. Now in here is uh, my walk-in wardrobe. So this is like all my clothes, all my suit jackets and clothes and various other bits and pieces in here, t-shirts and gym stuff and all that kind of thing. A uh, few of Jade's clothes as well, just over there. So as we work our way round, then we work our way into the uh, bathroom. So this is just like the ensuite bathroom for uh, Jade and I. So you can see me there in the mirror, yo. Um, yeah, so this is just kind of a sort of standard bathroom, really not very interesting. And then we work our way out. In there is just an airing cupboard, and then we come into the living room. So in the living room, first of all, on the TV, on the sorry, on the TV, on the wall there, we've got a I think it's a 55 or 60 inch um, LED LG TV. Been really, really impressed with this TV. It's absolutely fantastic. Nice and slim, great picture, and I've also got uh, all of the 3D glasses as well over there, along with another one of those kind of smelly things. Over here on the floor, we've got an Apple TV, and that one's actually got the iCarbon skin on it, which looks absolutely awesome. And then over here, just a little bit more, got another Airport Express over there that's actually linked to the other one, so I get really fast Wi-Fi throughout the house. And then if we just work our way around, you can see, just got a few kind of windows in here, a little lamp over there. On the table here, got the remote for Sky, for the TV and also for the Apple TV. And I've got another iPad 4, because that's another um, lightning connector just there. And then we've got my sofa. And then you can see my cat, Sesk, named after Sesk Fabregas, who left Arsenal for Barcelona shortly after. Uh, just chilling out there on the, uh, on the sofa. And you can kind of just see outside the house there as well. So this is the living room just here. I'll just kind of pan around for you. Really, really impressed with that TV as well. Very, very impressed. If you're wondering about all these wires and stuff, uh, just over here, that's my little boy as well, George. 
Uh, it's just because I haven't got round to finding a kind of nice unit that is going to go there in the corner. So, like I say, I don't want to just buy something for the sake of it. I want to make sure that I get the one that I exactly want. And I just haven't sort of managed to find one just yet. Uh, got a couple of these little dogs again that kind of just pin the doors open <laughs> just here. They're kind of cool because they've got like the same sort of material as the sofa. So you can see they're kind of similar. Uh, the cat as well. The cat is a Bengal cat. So that's why he's got these kind of cool markings. So anyway, out into the hallway. Um, I've got this suitcase here at the moment because... Um, I keep meaning to carry it upstairs and I just haven't had the time or energy to do it yet. So I'll just move that out of the way. Um, and then we work our way up to the third floor, just here. And then uh, again, there's a kind of another sort of landing area just up here. And then this leads off into sort of all of the different rooms that we've got. So first up, we've got one of the spare bedrooms, uh, which our friends uh, usually stay in when they come. Got a little uh, 24 inch TV up there on the wall, full HD TV. Uh, the HDMI cable comes at the bottom so people can plug stuff in. This is just the uh, guest bedroom really, so um, yeah, it's just literally just a bedroom. Uh, not much to say about a lot of this kind of house stuff, because a lot of it is just kind of boring house stuff. Uh, over there, just like a little kind of unit uh, with the remote control on for the TV. Now, if we work our way out of here, we come to Jade's dressing room, as you can probably tell. Dressing room? Dressing room as you can probably tell from all of the uh, shoes that are all kind of stacked up up here. So this is Jade's dressing room. Um, nice kind of light up there for her, her makeup sort of table with a mirror and whatnot. And like I said, quite a few shoes that she's kind of got here that cost me an absolute fortune. And then a couple of pictures on the wall as well that I got her as well uh, a couple of years back. There's the dog again, don't know what he's doing. Uh, another bedroom, uh, sorry, another bathroom just in here. Uh, this is really just kind of a guest bathroom, if you like, that everyone else can use while they're in here. And then we work our way into another spare room. So this one's actually got uh, an ensuite uh, shower and toilet as well for people that are just staying in this room. And then in here, got obviously another double bed, load of wardrobes as well. So if people are staying for a kind of longer period of time, they can. And uh, that's pretty much about it in this room. So yeah, there we go guys. That's a kind of room tour or house tour if you like. And uh, next door to this room is uh, my gym and also Georgie's room as well, but I'm gonna leave that one alone. So there we go. That is it guys. That's the end of the house tour. Dog wants me to chuck the toy down here so he can go and pick it up, but I'm not gonna do it today because he gets far too excited. And that's about it guys. That is the house tour over and done with hope you enjoyed it i know it was fairly quick but please do hit that like button and i will see you all in the next video see ya